Hey, uh, I'm Pat Porter. I'm the broker for Reckland Realty. Uh, most of you do not know who I am, haven't seen me before, uh, probably never heard of me or our company. I, no, I understand that, no problem. Uh, Reckland is a licensed uh, land broker in Louisiana, Arkansas, Mississippi, Texas, Iowa, and Missouri. And uh, for the longest time, I have kept my face out of things for obvious reasons. Um, if you look at our website, you don't see much about the personalities of any of our agents or me, as a matter of fact. Uh, you see a lot about Reckland. You see a lot about our uh, relationship with Duck Commander and Buck Commander. You see their faces, but you don't ever see ours. And that's been for a, a strategic reason for a number of years. And so we're doing something just a little bit different. Not interjecting uh, our personalities into Reckland so much as me just kind of pulling the curtains back a little bit behind our company and our brand and letting you see what's going on what we do day in day out the good the bad the ugly the unpolished uh the unpolished version of it so i'm riding down the uh, highway right here in uh, south washita parish heading to caldwell parish uh, the video is a little bumpy because i've got it mounted on a, a little dash suction cup on my windshield just to keep me from holding it just so i can you know drive a little more safely uh, my wife and some other people were fussing at me about trying to record something while i was driving so i thought this would be a good safe safe compromise so anyway uh here we are i'm gonna tell you a little bit about who reckland is uh what's going on what's happening uh, some of it's going to be interesting. Some of it's going to be boring to you, maybe. I don't know. Uh, some of it's going to be kind of cool, I think. Uh, you know, we're in a real unique business. Uh, we've got a, we do unique things all the time, a little different. Uh, it's not the same thing day in, day out by any means. And so, let's, I, I don't know if it'd be interesting to you or not, but you're seeing the very first video of our video blog and just kind of pulling the curtains back on Reckland just a little bit. And, Let's just see where it goes. Uh, so anyway, uh, I've been in the office most of the morning uh, working on some advertising for some of our properties. Uh, just kind of normal Monday morning stuff, just knocking out what's there. I uh, got a contract in, in the email uh, that we needed to get taken care of on a nice piece of property in Tinsall Parish. Got that knocked out. Uh, hopefully that'll get closed and you know that'll make the owners some money. Uh, anyway, just, just kind of normal stuff. And now I'm on the road down uh, to Columbia to a, a sporting goods store. It's uh, the Spotted Dog uh, uh, sporting, uh, sporting Goods there in Columbia, Louisiana. And I'm just gonna try to sell them our shirts. Uh, Reckland has got a, a little separate uh, thing going called Reckland Gear, where we sell uh, apparel and uh, different outdoor items. We've got a number of things on our website now. And uh, there's been some talk back and forth between the owner and my graphics guy, who's also our partner in Reckland Gear, uh, about the, the Spotted Dog having some interest in our, our Deep South and Reckland Gear shirts. So I, I'm gonna go down there and show them the shirts we have and uh, hopefully get them placed there. We've got them in a, uh, the Honey Hole in West Monroe and they've done real well there. And they've been pleased. And so I'm gonna go and talk to these folks and hopefully they'll want them. They're cool shirts, cool as all get out and we're adding to them all the time. We got a number of different color and uh, design variations. So we'll see. I, anyway, uh, I'm driving down the high, uh, highway here. Probably got another 15 to 20 minutes. Uh, the corn is coming up. I mean, it is everywhere. They obviously didn't get flooded out down here from all the rain that we had. Didn't Obviously didn't have to replant. Their corn is coming up good. Uh, I don't. It irritates me. Every once in a while I see a little property for sale like that with, with uh, they don't mean this in a bad way, but uh, you know, just some local res residential real estate company. I'm going, God dog, what are they doing listing a piece of property like that? that yeah, it needs to be with us, and it burns me up sometimes to see that. And I, I figure she, the, that agent's probably just related to whoever or knows somebody because she doesn't know. Anyway, don't get me started on that. But uh, I see a piece of land, real real estate for sale, and it's not a, a, a land company selling it. Always. Uh, gives me the reds a little bit and you know chaps me some but anyway that's a, that's another subject sorry i didn't mean to get off on that uh anyway uh there are going to be a number of these videos uh, on our video post on a video blog and 
uh, hopefully they'll be interesting to you. Hopefully, uh, you know, you, you'll you'll enjoy what you see. Sometimes it'll be stuff that you're going to be able to learn some things from uh, as we share our different experiences in different types of land. Uh, other times it may just be funny. Other times it may just be stupid. I don't know. But fortunately, that's why God invented the, you know, the on-off button on on the your video player if you don't like it just hit off and move on but if you do like it we hope you you know you'll stick around and come back and look at some more stuff i've got a lot of uh, different type of land agents i've got foresters uh, farmers uh, we're all outdoors people uh, some of us are professional hunters in my in missouri uh, we've got uh, uh, state wildlife biologists now uh, we've got people from all different walks of life but all of them, but the thing we all have in common is uh, the outdoor industry and rural property and so we've got a lot of different experiences that we can draw from we're forever on the phone with each other asking questions about certain types of land and uh, certain asking calling the foresters asking about timber calling so-and-so and asking about prices calling so-and-so and asking about soil types that's the cool thing about rec land and about what we do. There's a, we got a tremendous network of people that their, their experience and knowledge is so great. And we're not a, in competition with one another. We work together so well, and I'm grateful for that, that we can pick up the phone and call and ask questions about a track and not have to worry about the guy stealing our listing or, or stealing our buyer or you know undercutting us in some way. And that happens all the time. In, in, real estate mostly in these rec a lot of residential companies but it just doesn't happen with us and so consequently we can get a lot of good information on property uh, from our internal sources and help out our customers um, and you know I, I think that's gone a long way in us developing good relationships with people around the country developing a pretty good reputation is that you know we're not greedy uh, we, we share the knowledge that we have as much as we can. We work together as much as we can, all for the you know express purpose of helping our clients sell their property or, or buy the right track at the right price. And that's a cool thing about Reclam. You, you'll, you're going to get into that. We'll get into that more and more as we go. <clears throat> Probably have some stuff you know with our foresters and different things about timber or farmland or different recreational type properties. and. That's where you may learn some things along the way that you, that, that you didn't know that may be helpful to you in, in your, uh, your buying or selling land or be helpful to you in your managing your, the land you already have. You may just pick up a nugget here or there where you go, God dog, it was worth listening to those boys. You know, I, I learned something and, and it's not going to be, you know, slick textbook stuff. It's going to be basic uh, common sense things that we all have learned presented in just a good old boy way, you know, just straight talking and, and hopefully it'll be helpful. Uh, I'm getting pretty close to Spotted Dog here. I'm going to do my best to uh, get these Deep South and Rec Land Gear shirts in their store and, uh, you know, and then get probably head back to the office and, and uh, work on some more stuff on some, some different properties we have. We got a lot of mail outs going, uh, got a lot of new listings. Uh, just always a lot of stuff going, but I, I had this extra couple hours I was going to sneak in and go down here and visit this this uh, sporting goods store. So we'll see where that goes. Uh, it, it, until next time, hope you have a good day. Hope things go well for you, and, and we appreciate you watching. Thank you.